Each cylinder is fitted with a variable injection timing fuel pump. It is mounted on the roller guide housing on top of the camshaft. Two racks are fitted in the base of the pump. The upper rack is for adjusting the injection timing by timing guide and the lower rack is for adjusting the quantity of fuel oil delivered by the regulating guide. The pump barrel has a threaded lower end which fits into the internal threads of the timing guide. The timing guide has a gear rim which meshes with the upper tooth rack at the base of the pump housing. The position of the tooth rack determines the vertical position of barrel relative to the plunger and thus the time of the fuel injection. The pump plunger is fitted within the barrel to form an oil tight seal. The plunger is turned by the regulating guide which engages with the lower tooth rack. The position of the plunger determines the amount of oil injected into the cylinder. The top cover houses the puncture valve and suction valve. The oil is supplied to the pump through the spring loaded suction valve. The puncture valve is operated by the control air system. On actuation, it bypasses the oil through the boost to the pump housing and no injection takes place. 